Stacker on a journey to find silver. International Stacker. What is up, guys? International Stacker here to show you my port silver, but really quick, I hear something over here. What is this? Oh, uh, we got the Uncle Cell live stream, Salivate Metal. Shout out to Salivate Metal. Everyone in here, you're going to get a shout out. Look at all these great stackers on Mr. Monkey. He knows a lot about Egypt. Also, too, I got a new video jumping for you guys right now. Bouncing out, new video coming. But first, I'm here to talk to you about my port silver. So let me silence this. And let's get into it. So, uh, what I want to show you guys here is this is 700, sorry, I had to look at the numbers. This is 773 ounces of poured silver. There's my junk silver from the video I did a little bit earlier. This is 773 ounces of poured silver, and I'm gonna take you guys through it. Let's do it, let's have some fun. So first, two 100 ounce Johnson Matthew bars. These things are epic, iconic, I love them. This is one kilo bar, it's Asahi. And uh, the same company, I believe they bought out Johnson Matthew. We got some great Scottsdale silver here. These are 20 ounce uh, large Kit Kats, so that's 80 ounces there. Shout out to Tip Up Silver, he just commented on one of my videos. Uh, these are 10 ounce lows, so one, two, three, four. So that's another 80, you can see, 80 ounces there. These are super cool. These are poured silver uh, bars. Really awesome. Uh, so it's a different style kind of than these. These are all still poured, technically, uh, but it's a different style. And then we got these 100 grammers, four of those. Then we got the two 10 ounce buttons, which are pretty cool. Um, it's really big. It's bigger than a Snapple bottle top. I mean, it's almost like a gas cover. And I got two of these five. Sorry guys, I cannot lean over this table two of these five ounce Troys. So that's it for the Scottsdale. Awesome stuff, moving on. Backyard bullion in the house, our homie over in England. So we got some great pieces from here. These are all different weights. This is the silver form, uh, which he supports the silver form bar. And the cool thing about his silver guys, if you've never seen it, he pours in his backyard, but in England it all has to be hallmarked. So that's the assay office in um, Edinburgh. The BYB is his identifier and the rest um, is just the assay office saying that his stuff is legit. His little leaf, the little leaf is kind of his thing, his signature. So the kind of leaf on every one of the things. His silver is beautiful, guys. It's more expensive for a few reasons. One, silver is more expensive overseas, as we found out. Uh, two, it has to be hallmarked, which is a cost. And three, it's just freaking awesome. It has to ship internationally, but it's worth every cent. Moving on. I'm trying to get more community pours, guys. This is someone in the community called High Five. Great guy, check his videos out. There's a little symbol there. That's 1.9 ounces. So it's for the baby Dragos. Here is uh, one of the pillars of the community. He's been around a long time. Pit Bullion does great work. And his silver is like a little pit bull. Yep. So this is a five ounce Kit Kat. This is three ounce, two ounce, one ounce, one ounce. Uh, these are like 1.9, 1.8. These are like 1.8, 1.9. This one's like 5.3. That's 100 gram. Uh, moving over here, let me go around the side of the table. Oh man, my back is gonna hurt after this one, I can tell. I'm like having to bend over, guys. This is the Bunker Buster. I just did a video on. I don't wanna touch it with my hands because I wanna keep it Awesome, but look at this freaking thing. Hi-ho silver, bunker bullion, tasty silver. Hooked me up with this one of a kind prototype P6PO2. Beautiful bar. I think he's actually poured 10 of those. Here's some other hi-ho. Bunker bullions, 256. These are all like 1.8s. He does fantastic work, guys. Again, I think I'm going to keep this pristine. I don't think I'm going to touch it. This is Silver Slayer. He used to be really active in the community. Then he kind of got on the crypto chain train for a while. Then he just kind of fell off. 
I think he starts posting some stuff again, but he's not nearly as active as he used to be, and it used to be all precious metal. But Ericsson Mint made these for him, so that's Ericsson Mint, 10th ounce. This is my only piece of Asgard silver. Everyone always wants to get some of this. You guys, I cannot find this anywhere. I bought it off Provident a long time ago, and from what I gather, Asgard doesn't make any more silver. I can't find it on eBay, anything. So this seems like it's really, really rare. Sorry for that bird in the background, guys. This is Jaeger Port Silver. This is the piece that counterfeited me. I thought it was Silver Slacker. I'll show you the real piece in a second, but it's okay. It's awesome. Got a little cross, one ounce. So one ounce bare bones bars, two ounce bare bones, 100 grammer. This is my only bison bullion, but it's pretty sick. Seven ouncer, 37 out of 50. First 50 it's called. I got that a great deal on Atmex, I believe. Now we're getting into the man, the myth, the legend. One of the guys that got me into this really is Silver Slacker. These are all custom Silver Slacker pieces. So these are four troy ounces each. 34, 35, 34. Uh, these are awesome. These are two ounces, number 13. And the cool thing about these guys, number 12, is these are collabs. So you've got Silver Slacker on top, MK bars, and YPS. So like some of the coolest port silver companies and legends and youtube legends number 13 it's like a tool mark this is one of his gear sets matching sets it's number 109 i believe that's six five ounces these are a little youtube play button one ounce these are actually pretty limited this is the phoenix if you guys saw the video i lost my first phoenix number 56 in the french airport airport in france so if you guys see number 56 anywhere, let me know. I was so sad I had to go out and buy as many as I could find. So I got these three. They're all freaking awesome. But number 56 is missing. 81, yeah. So sad. <laughs> Moving on, this is some other limited silver slacker pieces. Uh, this is like a four ounce. I love when they do it on the side. Here's a little one ounce tombstones. A little piece from all of his different silver pours. We're gonna do into it, guys, stretch on my back. Here we go, I'm trying to make the video too long. Monument metals. You guys, I just went to Egypt. Now I know what a lot of this stuff is. This is Horus, that's Ra, uh, that's Ankh, that's the key of life for Egypt. Those are three ounces each, that's six. These are little one ounce guys. And see, this is uh, the Jackal. Uh, Pharaoh, the guy with the jackal head, he's the one that does all the embalming, or the mummification, I should say. These are all half ounces, super sick. They got the cat, I forget which one the cat is. Monkey swag, which one's the cat? And they got these little quarter ounces, these little tenth, or uh, half ounces. So, the scarab guys, which I love, is the god of like rejuvenation new, because they think that Ra takes the sun, or puts the sun, and then they think the scarab takes the sun away and puts the moon. You see, that's the eye of the pharaoh on top, and that's considered to be a sign of protection. These are little tenth ounces. Some coin, I forget who it is. This is Atlantis Mint. This is a limited bar. Number 153, I think it was like their five year anniversary or something. Here's another little Atlantis Mint bar. Picked that up in the LCS. Here's some half ounces. And for a long time, guys, I didn't even notice the skulls were on there. Look at that. 10 grammars, five grammars. Now, to my favorite one. Oh, that's a cool shot. To my favorite port silver maker, hands down, MK Bars. Let's get into it. So some of the specialty pieces, that's the uh, Statue of Liberty. Look at those poor lines, it's a five ounce. These two are limited. Five ounces. Look at that. Four lines are phenomenal. These are the Buccaneers, limited. Three ounces each. You see they're all numbered. This bell is one of 500, freaking awesome, 400. This little monkey, got him on a sale, five ounce. One of my favorite. I wish I got more of these. This is 10 ounce, guys. It's the Guy Fox or the Anonymous Got Mask, guys. It's freaking a phenomenal bar. 
And guys, I was getting this stuff before I ever went to Egypt because I like that stuff. This is a little pharaoh. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six of those, two ounces each. These are limited pirate uh, diamonds, guys. So there's 500 of them. These are two ounces. So one, two, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So that's what, 24 ounces? 22 ounces, I'm sorry. Uh, got some of these little shipwreck rounds. These freaking things are awesome. Look at that. I feel like this is like what you'd really find in a shipwreck. Look at that. Every piece is different. That's what's cool about poured silver. And you guys, this is just a, an ounce from Sons of Liberty. I don't actually think this is poured. I just include it, whatever. Uh, these are little two ounce limited edition Pharaoh heads, skeleton heads. 1.5 limited edition Pharaoh heads. This is a shield, that was pretty cool. I'm gonna get more of these. It's a barrel of rum, pretty cool. They make, he makes bigger ones. Does he make a kilo of this? I'm not sure, he makes kilo bars, guys. It's freaking awesome. These are little rounds, so that's the Egyptian eye and like pirate looking stuff. Older pirate, pharaoh, that's an older pirate round. Uh, some pirate squares. These are all little one ounce pirate squares. Freaking super cool. I feel like that's what pirates would have traded with in the back in the day. Uh, these are little two ounce pirate squares. Let's see, pretty really super cool. Just chunky, man. Just raw and chunky. These are little sunken skull guys. These are super cool. They're all one ounce. I want I don't want so much more of these. This is some little Celtic, I think, design. I picked that up. Two two ounce. Uh, these are just some like original kind of one ounce little squares. These are some one ounce Kit Kats. These are the two ounce Kit Kats. And look at these things. I love how they're just like, look at that. I love that. Uh, yeah, guys. <laughs> so that's the stack. I got there in 11 minutes and 55 seconds. I feel like that's pretty good. And just to give you guys kind of a rundown, I keep a spreadsheet of everything. So I did an audit today. So I got 147. MK bars, YPS, you can see all the people there. So the total is 773. And you guys, I'll catch you on the next video. But again, shout out to Uncle Sal. Let's unmute this. Uh, Pressing, actually tricky guy, but. And let's do a shout out to all these people. Kindle Kid, Good Donald, Tricky, Clonic, Terry, Alpha, Janorm. Keith Hyatt says, Genorm. all I know is that someone farts wrong. Overseas, that gold and silver will go up and down. Everything so is ran by fear in the stock That's market. funny, guys. All right, guys. Well, uh, if you don't know Salivate Metal, check them out. And shout out to all these people. And guys, I will catch you on the next one. International Stacker.